the Gasparilla Bowl. Wake Forest in Missouri. Missouri is a one-point underdog. The total sits at 59.5 over at BetUS. It's a Friday, December 23rd game at 5.30 p.m. Central Time. And this is another one that let's go on and pull up the uh, the numbers here for you. Uh, Wake Forest, since week eight of the season, would be favored by 3.46 to me. Now, it, there's several guys opting out, etc. It doesn't look like, um, I don't know. It, it's, it doesn't look like anybody of real substance is going to sit out this game. I think Sam Hartman's going to play. I think those wide receivers are going to play. Um, I, that's at least that's what I'm. As, from from the information that I've got, that's that's what I'm hearing. Uh, and if those two or if those guys are going to play, well, then I'm going to have to go with Wake Forest here. I know that they weren't great towards the end of the season, but you look at this. I think there's a distinct advantage for this Wake Forest passing offense against Missouri's defense. Um, Wake Forest offense, number 29, PPA per drive. At the Missouri defense over the last, you know, six weeks of the season, number 50. They were significantly better earlier in the year. Uh, the issue is this Wake Forest defense late in the year. And the Missouri offense certainly has gotten better. Number 18 PPA per pass, number 23 passing success rate. That happens to be the weakness of this Wake Forest defense. But they're only throwing the ball like 43, 44% of the time. So definitely something to pay attention to. They they can't really run it all that well. Um, Wake Forest a little bit better at stopping the run. So that's one thing. You look at penalties per game, Missouri number 117 and Wake Forest number 14. Turnover margin, both are pretty terrible. Uh, Sam Hartman got a got a case of the, the picks late in the year. Uh, Missouri is number 88 in turnover margin. Wake Forest number 91. So no real advantage either way there. You look at net points per drive. That's the, the biggest difference here. The biggest indicator to me. Wake Forest is number 34 there. Uh, and this is for the whole season. Number 34 and Missouri number 64. Um, it, a big difference in place per game. You know, all, all kinds of things. So, you know, uh, strength of schedule certainly favors Missouri, uh, but team strength favors Wake Forest. I'm going to roll with Sam Hartman. I trust him to be able to get a, uh, a win here. So go ahead and give me Wake Forest to cover that one. I know that line has come down, uh, but I just trust them more. I trust Dave Clawson. Uh, I think all the, all the stuff that was going on where Sam Hartman might sit out because he might transfer or he might go to the NFL, all that's been cleared away. Dave Clawson is not leaving for another job. That's been cleared away. I think these guys want to come out and get a good win here. So I will take Wake Forest minus the one. Psst. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and of course, jump in the comments. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.